You're listening to the BBM Global Network with 25 years in broadcast audio and video production. Our passionate team creates content and marketing for the world of Internet talk radio. If you've got a passion, come join us at BBMGlobalNetwork.com. The BBM Global Network. Your voice is now heard. self-expression. The most effective way to express ourselves is through words. But according to the Stuttering Foundation, close to 80 million people worldwide stutter today. This is Live Stutter Free with your host, Anna Dieter. After years of practicing conventional speech therapy, Anna Dieter has pioneered a new and effective approach to this debilitating habit. So now, please welcome the host of Live Stutter Free, Anna Dieter. Good part of the day and welcome to Live Stutter Free with your host, Anna Dieter, a founder and a passionate pioneer of the brand new profession called Adalon Speech Education. My very first show is coming to you live from Sunshine, Florida, USA, through BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. Yes, they say that according to the official statistics, 1% of the world population suffers from this incurable sickness called stuttering, stammering, speech fluency disorder, or whatever they call it with something else. It is a fact that English-speaking people use close to 300 synonyms for the word stutter and only one antonym, the word with the opposite meaning. You will discover what this simple word is and how important it is for liberating 80 million people worldwide who hope and pray daily that one day in some unknown future a smart doctor or a genius speech pathologist, therapist will find a cure for the mysterious stuttering sickness. I am Anna Dieter, and I'm just a messenger of a great news. Stuttering is solved. Live Stutter Free will spread the message of truth to millions of those who stutter, to their families dealing with the daily struggle of the loved one who stutters, to thousands of speech and language professionals out there who, without the right tool in their hands, genuinely and passionately, really do a good job the best they can to ease this struggle. So stuttering is solved. Its definitive cause, mechanism, and solution for its 100%, not less, 100% elimination in only three days was determined in 1998. Can you believe that? Yes, 20 years ago, thousands People have become unblocked, stopped stuttering over all these years, and today they enjoy their stutter-free life. So who and how made such a revolutionary discovery? And what is the reason that you most likely have never heard about this scientific breakthrough? And If stuttering was really solved 20 years ago, then why so many people in the world today continue to suffer? Well, until now, stuttering was raising only questions without realistic answers. Live Stutter Free will change this situation. I am Anna Dieter, a messenger 
of the truth about stuttering business. Yes, no more mystery. Stuttering cure is a multi-billion dollar business. Tune in and you will discover so many amazing, exciting, but disgusting not easy to digest, and quite disturbing facts. Uh, to name just a few, you will learn how one Russian psychiatrist, not a speech professional, psychiatrist, and a dirty politician invented this bogus, never proven to exist, stuttering sickness, and how he made a fortune of his criminal invention in 1889, many, many years ago, how he was able to silence those true, bright sci uh, scientists who didn't agree with his delusional hypothesis about stuttering as a, some kind of a medical condition. You will learn how he and later his pretty dumb and greedy followers, unfortunately, starters themselves, created and developed a whole new industry called, guess what's the title? <laughs> what's the name of this industry? Yep, speech, language, pathology or therapy. So you may ask, how do I know all these facts and who am I <laughs> so boldly speaking up like that? It is very simple. I am Russian. I was born and raised in Russia. I earned my degree, master's degree in speech, language therapy and special education from the University of Education in Russian city, Yekaterinburg. Teaching speech skills to people of different ages has been my life passion. I have worked 30 plus years as a conventional speech therapist in two countries and, of course, in two languages. But six years ago, I had a revelation. I realized that the whole approach towards speech as a medical condition, medical problem, was wrong and is wrong and must be changed. So let the show begin with answering the first series of questions. And the question number one, who solved stuttering problem 20 years ago and why don't you know about it. His name is Roman Alexeyevich Snishko, this independent, courageous scientist, lives in Russia. And he doesn't speak English language. But this is not the only reason for why English speakers never heard his name. So the further we go, the more questions arise. And uh, we are going to take breaks every 10 minutes. And uh, we're going to rest for a minute or two. So what I recommend, you drink some water. You maybe moisturize your body. They say it's very healthy. Yeah. But don't you go away as this information that you will hear in the show has the power to save your life, the life of your loved one or your student. So in the next segment, you will hear the answer to this question. Talk to you in a bit. The earliest human societies worshipped a female goddess. Little is known about this time because we did not always have a written recorded history. It was around 3100 BC when the Sumerians invented the first written language and everything that preceded this time is prehistory. The prehistorical record includes all of women's unwritten history from 30,000 B.C. to the time that men began achieving political power around 3,000 B.C. Male feminist artist Kimberly Berg maintains a strong position in educating and inspiring both men and women through his devotional art to the goddess in all women. Studying their history is paramount to understanding who women were 
and who they would become later, living in a patriarchal society. To learn more about this important time in our history, go to www.isisrising.net. Do you ever wonder why certain things are happening in your life? How to start a business or a new direction? Need answers? Astrologer Bonnie Perbula can help you reveal your true self and gain strength and focus so you can achieve greater joy and success. Working with a natal birth date, time, and location, Bonnie brings out qualities to aid you in getting the best from your life. She can help you unlock dormant traits to bring you greater awareness. Bonnie also conducts public speaking engagements to educate aspiring astrologers on their journey to the stars. A gifted artist, Bonnie bridges her talents and recently launched a line of Astro Bears, uniquely created in colors of individuals' astrology charts. She also makes one-of-a-kind necklaces of crystal beads and woven thread. To learn more about the world of Bonnie Prabula, go to BonnieGPrabula.com and for astrology consulting, visit AstrologyConsultants.com or call or email her at 808-526-1536 or BonnieGP at AOL.com. Yes. Hi. Live Starter Free with your host, Anna Dira, keeps going on. BBM Global Network and TuneIn Radio have trusted me their live microphone. I'm the founder and a passionate pioneer of the brand new profession called Etalon Speech Education. A little note on the side, Etalon stands for perfection, for ideal example, for the standard of measurement. So Etalon Speech Education. I am here to disclose many truths that we, the people, have being fed over the last hundred plus years. It is my mission to answer the most difficult questions about this man-man, man-made sickness called stuttering, stammering, cluttering, mumbling, and any other name they they have come up with with so-called speech fluency disorders. In the first segment, I mentioned the name of a gentleman, by uh, Roman Alexeyevich Nishko, who solved the puzzle of stuttering in 1998. This independent, courageous scientist lives in Russia and doesn't speak English language, but this is not the only reason why English speakers never heard his name or about his discovery. So why do I call him independent and courageous? Why is it that his name is still not in the list of the Nobel Prize recipients? Why was this scientific breakthrough kind of ridiculed by some representatives of the stuttering cure business? I am Anna Dieter. Since 2012, I have unblocked, enabled people to stutter. More than 100 former stutterers over Skype in only three days. I'm the author of nine books in two languages on the subject of stuttering and speech education. I have written most of them together with and under scientific supervision of my mentor, Academic Snishko. Today, you can uncover a lot of mysteries about stuttering sickness. You may go to the website of the nonprofit speech academy at Alon International by Snishko. And you can download my free ebooks. And the website is www.livestarterfree, L I V E S T U U T T E R F R E E, livestarterfree.com. So you can also purchase a hard copy of the book entitled Speech is a Skill. That's right. Speech is a skill, not a medical condition. If you're not living in the USA, its hard copy is also available on Amazon.com. And for much smaller contribution in the nonprofit organization, you may purchase this book from the website in the PDF format 
under the title of Live Starter Free. You also can call my cell phone, which is 323-896-1214. This is my life. This is my cell phone. You can call and ask any questions because I have all the answers about stuttering. But let's begin answering questions that have never been answered realistically until now. So, uh, one million <laughs> question first. What causes stuttering? If we open any source of information today, we will see pretty much the same statement. No one knows what causes stuttering, but speech therapy may help. Wait a second. No one knows what causes stuttering, including speech therapists. But for some reason, they are the ones chosen that we trust the life our lives and the life of our loved ones to help with this problem that they have no idea how to help. So together as a society, we have been programmed to believe the misconception that stuttering is caused by some kind of a physical abnormality of a person who stutters. Something is wrong with stutter's brain he cannot think adequately, his breathing system is broken, and he cannot breathe adequately. It's a genetic problem. He is born with this problem, medical condition. The list of hypotheses and speculation may go on and on. Thousands of researchers have attempted in vain to solve the problem of stuttering over the past 100 plus years, but still today. They still don't have a clear answer to these questions. What is stuttering? What is the reason for a strange behavior of those who stutter? And why can't they speak normally like everyone else, like 99% of the population? Unfortunately, to these days, all the researchers are mostly stutterers themselves. And they still mistakenly convinced, mistakenly believe that stuttering is some kind of a sickness or a medical disorder, and it requires a cure. Academic Snishko is, was the first scientist to discover the revolutionary truth. He noticed and proved on thousands of people, of course, former stutterers today. He noticed that mostly, and these people are mostly, of course, li living in Russia. They speak Russian language. But he noticed that stuttering is not a sickness. A person who stutters does not require any type of cure treatment, or even much speech training. But what is it? And why people stutter? Stuttering is a person's blockage, a set of blocks. People stutter because they are blocked. And guess what is the first and main complaint I hear from each of my students when they enter my three-day at alone classroom. So hang around and you will hear it after the commercial break. You don't want to miss the next segment as I will share with you the most breaking news about what really causes stuttering. What is this so-called block stupor? Talk to you in a bit. Essential Nutrients LLC is the brainchild of entrepreneur Barbara Burns. Inspired by a desire to help others, Barbara worked with a team of scientists to develop unique nutritional liquid supplements with the goal to improve the quality of your life. Glucosamine, zinc, and calcium are essential to well-being, and this is the focus of Essential Nutrients LLC. 
Whether you're a professional athlete, weekend warrior, student, business owner, or homemaker, Essential Nutrients offers products for everyone, including the family pet. And they're easy to take, no pills. Health requires commitment, exercise, a good diet, proper supplementation, and action. So take action today and get your supply of essential liquid nutrients by visiting www.essential-liquids.com. Don't put off your health any longer. Take essential products today and start to measure the difference. Unleash the obstacles that bind you with certified professional coach Joanne Charette, a master practitioner in energy leadership. Joanne can help you break through personal and professional barriers and guide you to a higher level of empowerment and fulfillment. Passionate and dedicated, Joanne engages with her clients on a mutual journey. Her dynamic energy will motivate you to move forward as you partner on a venture to greater results. Isn't it time to make a breakthrough and commit to live the life you deserve? Invest in yourself and let Joanne Charette be the captain catalyst to the realization of your dreams by making them a reality. Based in Quebec, Canada, Joanne is also a space coach, using social media and Skype to work with anyone anywhere around the world. Contact Joanne Charette today at 819-360-3266 or email her at actionrealization at live.ca 819-360-3266 Now is your time. Live Starter Free with the host Anna Dieter is back. The truth about stuttering cure business and speech education is coming to you live through BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. You will finally discover the ultimate truth about what really causes stuttering and what its mechanism is. Such discovery was made by an independent Russian scientist, academic Roman Snishko, 20 years ago, but it was rejected by the stuttering cure industry. Why? It's a big question, and you will learn the answer to it very soon. Maybe even today, if I'm not running out of time. So once again, what is the cause and what is the mechanism of stuttering? Why do people stutter? The cause. And the mechanism of stuttering is a so-called block, stupor. And guess what is the first complaint that I hear from my students when they come, when they step in my Adalon classroom? They say, I cannot say the word. I cannot say something is not letting me to say these words. I don't know what's blocking me. I have a block. And guess what? This is true. Every person who stutters is blocked. So because he has he or she has this invisible to him and to other ordinary people, including speech therapists, invisible blocks called block stupor. So look up the meaning of the word stupor. I'm just giving you the definition from the online dictionary. They call stupor is a state of near unconsciousness or insensibility. So basically when a person doesn't in his conscious at the moment, but each and every person who stutters is blocked. And until he or she is unblocked, any type of speech treatment, any type of speech training is useless. This is the reason that millions of people go through all kinds of stuttering cure procedures, therapists, all kinds of use all kinds of devices, all kinds of training with limited to no success at all. Over the course of Live Starter Free series, I will practically demonstrate and explain what these block stupors are, how people obtain them, and how they restrict stutterers' freedom to move adequately in their speech 
to move adequately their speech organs out of thousands of former stutterers from various countries, you will meet several stutter-free etalon program graduates, and you will hear their heartbreaking, authentic stories. They themselves will tell you about years of the inhuman stuttering prior to coming to me and getting unblocked in the three-day Etalon Speech Gymnastics online course. You will learn how they stopped stuttering, how they started speaking normally right after they got unblocked, almost instantly. Usually it takes 15, 20 minutes to a couple of hours to gain back the freedom of moving your body, your speech organs in the same way God or Mother Nature created them. I am Anna Dieter, a founder and a passionate pioneer of a brand new profession, etalon speech education, etalon speech educator. I am the, I'm on the mission to answer the most difficult questions about stuttering, the questions that have never been answered realistically before until now. So the next question, who and when block people and turn them into stutters? Stutterers become blocked in their early childhood when they first learn to believe some horrible lies about themselves. They learn that they are abnormal, that something is physically damaged in them, that they need someone's help with their speaking. They need a cure for their sickness. This fundamentally wrong belief restricts their self-development and self-growth. It simply blocks their freedom of their bodily movement in the same way a person becomes restricted by such physical limiters as, for example, handcuffs, chains, fetters, ropes, and so on. Just like a person tied up with a rope or chained up, every stutter is restricted, limited in his or her movements. A person who stutters is blocked. But can we call someone let's say, in handcuffs or shackles, sick. Is this person ill? Or he is simply restricted? Of course, he is restricted. He cannot move adequately because of the physical restrictor, the, the limiter. So each other has his own unique set of so-called block stupors of denial. Each of them deny something, and they all deny the ultimate truth of being born 100% normal and capable of speaking normally, just like everyone else. There is nothing wrong with them. They also deny the simple truth that no normal speakers on the planet ever use any methods any techniques to speak adequately their words, to say adequately their words. By attempting to say any word according to any method or technique, they simply deny the whole meaningful word gifted to us by God, if you believe in God, or Mother Nature. All people who started deny the word the original and integral word. This is the main block. It restricts their natural speech flow, right? Every starter is dreaming about the speech flow, but at the same time, they deny the, all the tools they have to make this flow free, okay? So the block stupor of denial is one, and the only cause and the mechanism of stuttering. 
Okay, so we are coming to the commercial break. We have a few seconds. So you don't want to go anywhere far away because you will learn where do these blocks come from and who block people who stutter. Talk to you in a bit. Animal lover, author, artist, and public speaker, Patricia Daly Life is a Renaissance woman in her own right. A lover of animals from a young age, Patricia lives on a farm in Virginia and has rescued neglected thoroughbred horses, keeping them or finding them safe havens. She is also a published author, and her books document real life experiences that she shares in her passionate stories, taking the reader around the world in a colorful kaleidoscope of life. An accomplished artist, Patricia Daly Life's oil paintings feature animals, portraits, stills, nature, and abstract, and she allows the brush to paint the image in an organic, natural way. A public speaker, Patricia is motivated to continually wonder about life and advocates for all of us to do the same and document our own unique history. To learn more about Patricia Daly Life, visit www.literarylady.com and www.patricialife.com or email her at pdlife at gmail.com. Hello, I'm Steve Fagan, and I'm president and CEO of Fagan Associates, but I'm also a life coach. I'm here to help you reach your dreams, goals, and objectives. As a life coach, it's my job to be your support, to be your teammate, to help you understand what is your dream, what is your life passion, and then together we work as that team to help you reach your specific goals. Life is worth living the best you can be. Working with a life coach, you're fulfilling those dreams and goals is your passion, and it's your way of living. Let me help you do that today. Let me help you really reach the best that you can be as a person and live the life you should be living. I'm Steve Fagan. I'm a life coach, and I'm here for you. Contact Steve Fagan at FaganAndAssociatesInc.com or call 1-800-239-2701. And I'll be glad to help you move forward to live the life of success. Reach your dreams, your goals, your objectives. We can do it together. And you are listening to Live Starter Free with your host, Anna Dieter. I'm coming to you live with BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. So, once again, I'm here to disclose a lot of truths about so-called stuttering, stammering, cluttering, or whatever they call this speech fluency, so-called speech fluency disorder, sickness. 80 million people worldwide and roughly 4 million Americans suffer from this bogus, man-made, man-made sickness. They struggle daily. And the truth was already discovered in 1998 by the Russian scientist, academic Roman Snishko. And he is the author of the three-day Etalon Speech Gymnastics Program for the elimination, 100% elimination of people of stuttering. I have already explained earlier that re in reality, stuttering is not a sickness, not a neurological disorder, not a genetic problem, not a medical condition that would require a cure or treatment ever. The real cause and the mechanism of stuttering is the block stupor of denial. Now, where do these blocks come from? The very first blocks are always coming from the environment where the child is being raised. So most of the time, of course, it's the family members, parents, or some other caretakers, or just other people around the baby. A child may get blocked in a stressful situation. For example, when the parent comes home from work, tired, wants a moment of silence, but the baby is just screaming, freely expressing himself, and the parent goes like, oh, can I just shut up? And you scream one more time, I'm going to beat your butt, right? That's all what it takes. The child obeys. The child learns that speaking up is dangerous and that he may be punished 
for using freely his voice. He begins to deny, hide his voice and his free self-expression. This is the first block as the result of believing this basically lie. The child withdraws and isolates himself from others. He is no longer expressing himself freely. He is no longer speaking. He is just listening to others, suppressing his natural desire of self-expression. He is blocked. But no one can see his invisible blocks, handcuffs. Another block may be acquired by a child as the result of improper speech of people around him. When they speak too fast, when they repeat words or parts of the words, when they stumble, when they stutter, parents may be making simply stutterous mistakes themselves without even realizing that they do so. So, and by hearing only damaged speech, abnormal speaking, a child kind of gets blocked. These bad speakers block this child's ability to hear, copy, imitate, and develop normal speech. And then the parents, conditioned by the whole society, take their struggling child to the next set of blockers. So the first blockers are parents, and the next set of blockers are, you can't believe, you will not believe, speech therapists, speech pathologists, and other conventional professionals that deal today with stuttering problem. They diagnose, of course, because they're medical professionals, all they do, they diagnose the child with a stuttering sickness. And they begin supplying him, his parents, of course, and him, with various methods and technique of the stuttering cure. They instill the main block in this child's mind. You are sick and you need a cure. Wait for the cure. Don't do anything else. You have to wait for someone or something to cure you. Such a lie blocks this child's self-development and his natural ability to adequately contact with the word because our speech is all about words. But instead of unblocking this child, increasing the amount of his exposure to the word, feeding his memory with entire word, and boosting his experience of saying this word adequately from the beginning to the end. Speech specialists, so-called specialists, make him to do all kinds of exercises irrelevant to the whole word. They program children to demolish the word, break it into syllables, and distorts the stress structure or accent structure of the word. Young children learn to speak in syllables. And of course, they stress every vowel in the word, which is totally abnormal. Normally, every word has only one stress. Now, yeah, in longer words, rarely, there could be two stresses. But most of the time, the majority of words have only one stress. But conventional speech therapists teach the child to break words and syllables, to sing, to exercise his tongue and lips, make faces, move all kinds of body parts, do all kinds of things, all at a false pretense of help. <laughs> okay, sometimes oral motor practice. They make a person struggling to develop normal speech. They make him do all kinds of things that are totally irrelevant to the word. Okay? Starters go through all kinds of mockery, which has nothing to do with gaining an adequate experience with a word. 
As the result, they believe firmer and firmer the untruth that they are abnormal. They need a cure and they get blocked stronger and stronger. So we are coming to the next break. Hang around, live starter free, and you will learn why today's stuttering cure specialists are not really efficient in their work with stutterers and even harmful. Their work even harmful. Talk to you in a bit. Patricia Fayweather Harlow is passionate about the environment and conserving our natural resources. She's written a five-part book series for all ages called Rock with Rodney and Party with Perky to Preserve Wildlife, which brings awareness through these vibrant characters on preserving and protecting our national parks and historic landmarks. Harlow has launched a campaign to mobilize green supporters, informing a united front against big oil, big coal, and the Keystone XL pipeline, and she addresses the controversial practice of fracking in books four and five. She's determined to bring greater awareness to the dangers of drilling and running crude oil through pipelines that cut through pristine landscapes, and she empowers readers to take action in keeping America beautiful. To learn more about Patricia Fayweather Harlow and to purchase her books, visit www.patricia-fayweather-harlow.com. That's F-A-Y-E-R-W-E-A-T-H-E-R. And play your part in preserving the landscape that we all share and love. Hi, my name is Myra Fox, and I am a survivor. I am the founder of the Castle Lewis I Survived Foundation and the author of a series of books entitled I Survived a Murder Untold, which tells the story of my sister and I who were abandoned and left in the care of a woman who beat us repeatedly. Unfortunately, it resulted in the death of my sister, Castle Lewis, which is revealed in a page-to-page -page chilling story. After spending time in the foster care system, I've documented my suffering and my loss and ultimately my survival. I'm blessed to work daily in my community and surrounding areas to give back by helping others and feeding the homeless. I want to spread awareness of the dangers of abuse. You can purchase my books and contribute to the Castle Lewis I Survive Foundation by visiting www.castlelewis.com or you can call us at 540-999-8401. Thank you. Thank you so much for listening to Live Starter Free with your host, Anna Dieter, a passionate pioneer of restoring the profession of speech education, oratory art, as they called it in ancient times. I'm coming to you live through BBM Global Network and TuneIn Radio, and we are talking about stuttering cure business and speech education. I'm answering the most difficult questions that have never been answered realistically before until now. Earlier, I have introduced the block stupor as the cause and the mechanism of stuttering. And I have also explained who blocks a healthy child and turns him into a stutterer. It's parents, speech therapists, all kinds of doctors, and then the whole society comes into the picture. There is a wide variety of blockers, doctors, therapists of all sorts, hypnotists, magicians, sorcerers, wizards, priests, pills, devices. They all promise to cure stutterers. Those who offer their help may be kind and genuine people, but because they have no skill, no training how to liberate their patients from blocks, stutterers remain block, blocked. And what is the reason that stuttering cure specialists are not really efficient in their work. It is because they all promise and attempt to cure stutters who in reality are healthy people, healthy but blocked. Their blocks are invisible not only to stutters themselves, but for their helpers as well. This is why all these stuttering cure specialists cannot remove these blocks from stutters, from their patients, how they call them. 
Every block stupor is like handcuffs that restricts a person to move freely his body, his speech apparatus. In order to unlock and remove these handcuffs, someone has to have a key to unlock the lock on the handcuffs. Academic Roman Snishko is the first scientist to discover the key for unblocking any person who stutters. Stutterers are not sick people. They are healthy people, but limited with two types of blocks. It's the internal block of block stupor that they have, okay, the denial, and also with various external influence, the block that they have that is coming from outside. It's a stuttering cure influence, stuttering cure methods, techniques, tips, tricks, and other useless so-called help. Note that normal people do not use any speech methods, never train their speech, never go through the articulatory training or breathing practice. Normal people simply rely on their word, which cause which does all the work inside of a person. The word sorts out any situation. The word is the central control program that manages both the mind and the body. Of course, speech apparatus of a speaker. And we basically do not really participate consciously in the speech process. Just ask any normal people, how do you speak? And he will honestly answer, I don't know. This question is similar to how do you make your heart beat? Or how do you move your fingers? People will always answer, I don't know. And this is exactly what natural speech is. Academic Snishko has figured it out how to unblock any stutterer who instantly becomes free to move his speech organs and to speak normally, just like all other health, healthy people. So since 1998, my mentor, academic Roman Snishko, has unblocked thousands of former stutterers in only three days. He has proved that it is a block stupor of denial that causes a person to develop a so-called logophobia, the fear of speaking. Every stutterer denies the word. He simply or she doesn't accept it. And they say always, my students, when they come to my classroom, they always say, oh, I have these difficult sounds. I have these difficult letters, P, T, D, R, a vowel sound. And they deny the part of this word. By denying the part of the word, they deny the whole word. So it is the same as, let's say, you want to drive a car, right? But you deny, you don't like something, some parts in your car. And you kind of, let's say, this part of the car are wheels, is a wheel. So how can you drive a car without wheels? <laughs> of course you can't. You got to accept and attach the part of the car, the wheels. So the car you would be able to accept the whole car and drive it, okay? So, but if you continue to deny any part of the car, you will never be able to accept the whole car. Without the wheels, the car will always remain restricted to move freely. It will always remain, will always remain blocked. No cure, treatment, or training would ever help this car to move freely because the parts are denied. You denied the parts. The blockage denial of any part must be removed first before the whole object could be accepted or used. The same goes for unblocking a stutterer. Only after he has accepted each and every part of the word, he can accept the whole word, accept and say the whole word. No treatment, no training can help a person with that. Blocks must be removed first. In order to help a stutterer, it is crucial to understand the mechanism of stuttering. 
But unfortunately, everyone keeps repeating still today that stuttering is a mysterious sickness with no known cure. Oh, well. By denying the word, a stutter denies the situation that this word requires. And he begins to hide from the word, from speaking situation that requires this word. He isolates himself from others. Stutterers become introverts. And this is the reason of their blocks. So we're coming to the last commercial break. When we come back, you will learn the answer to the question, why this is happening? What's going on in the world of stuttering? And thank you so much for listening to Live Stutter Free. See you in a bit. Intergenerational programming is uniting America due to the tireless efforts of Dr. Ramona Frischman. Retired from the Miami-Dade County Public School System, Dr. Frischman continues to develop intergenerational learning programs aimed to improve the lives of children, young adults, and seniors through unique strategies and public policy in order to establish a mutually supportive agenda. She views intergenerational programs as a resource for policymakers and the general public on economic, social, and personal initiatives that govern our society. Her work bridges the generational gap, providing many individuals the opportunity to explore areas of common ground and celebrate each other's diversity. Contact Ramona Frischman at RamonaLong at AOL.com or visit www.gu.org to learn more about intergenerational programming. My Dreams, My Challenges, and Joys is an inspiring book by author Linda Genazzo. This real-life account of raising a child with autism from birth to adulthood takes you on a journey of compassion, love, and hope as it tells the incredible story of a devoted family and their beloved daughter. Together, they faced adversity and never stopped believing they would find the help they were seeking. A breast cancer survivor, Linda Genazzo has a giving heart. With a background in social work with the mentally ill and the homeless, Linda continues to help families in her community. And her book, My Dreams, My Challenges and Joys, brings greater awareness to autism and those families in need. To purchase your copy, visit www.lindagenazzo.com. It's also available on Amazon.com and BarnesandNoble.com. Don't delay. Get your copy today. And you are listening to Live Starter Free with a host, Anna Dieter, on BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. So I am releasing the truth. I'm disclosing the truth about stuttering business and why all types of speech training or speech treatment or stuttering cure are useless without a prior unblocking of a person who stutters. We will talk about it in details over the next show next Friday, but you just got to understand that Whenever a person is blocked, it is useless to train him in any way. So I encourage you to go and check out a lot of information I have released freely on my website, which is www.livestarterfree.com. And you can also download my free ebooks and read them to learn a lot the truth about the stuttering cure business and you can also go and for smaller contribution in the non-profit organization speech academy at alone international you may purchase a hard copy of the book speech is a skill or a pdf version of it for only $50 of your contribution in my mission and my passionate work, the book is entitled Live Starter Free. You can download it from the website. My phone number that you can reach me anytime is 323-896-1214. And the number to call BBM Global Network live is 866 866- 
451-1451. And in conclusion, I would like to emphasize the revolutionary truth. Stuttering is solved. Its precise cause and the mechanism has been determined. The reliable, efficient, and 100% scientific solution for the elimination of stuttering is found today. If you or your loved one stutter, or if you assist stutterers, you can take advantage of my intensive work today. So self-expression is the most precious gift we have been given by Mother Nature or God, if you believe in God. There is no need to continue suffering, living with the fear of not being able to express yourself. Anyone can be unblocked in only three days today and enjoy their starter-free life. The next show, you really would like to listen to my next show because I will invite an amazing guest, the very first English man who was unblocked in the three-day Etalon classroom almost six years ago. He will share with you how this thing happened, how we never, back then, we, I, myself and he, we didn't know much about this revolutionary discovery, how we learned it all together, how he got unblocked. But the most important thing that I'm interested in is to learn how people develop blocks. So I will see you, I mean, not see, I will he you will hear from me next Friday, and I hope I'm going to be able to hook up with all video platforms on Facebook, Instagram, WhatsApp, and others. Lots of love to you, Anna Dieter. Live starter free. You've been listening to Live Stutter Free with your host, Anna Dieter. Listen each week and learn how to become unblocked, liberated, and live stutter free with host, Anna Dieter. You've been listening to the BBM Global Network. The ideas, views, and opinions of this broadcast are those of the participants of the program and are not necessarily the ideas, views, and opinions of the BBM Global Network Company.